The current state of the Rust shooting inquiry as the FBI disputes Alec Baldwin's account. Actor Alec Baldwin has maintained for months that he did not fire the gun that fatally shot a member of the crew when they were filming in New Mexico. However, fresh forensic data can present a different picture. The Santa Fe County Sheriff's Office is in charge of the investigation. The FBI recently completed and provided a report to them. Authorities discovered that the prop gun could not be fired without pushing the trigger. In a statement to NPR, Baldwin's attorney described the FBI's conclusions as misconstrued and added that the involved pistol was in poor condition. According to the Santa Fe County Sheriff's Office, the investigation into the incident is ongoing and nobody has been accused of any crime thus far. What took place and Baldwin's reaction? The event happened in October as Baldwin was practicing a scene for the upcoming Western film Rust on the outskirts of Santa Fe. The actor was rehearsing drawing a pistol and aiming it at the camera at the time. When the gun went off, a bullet hit and wounded the film's director, Joel Souza, as well as the cinematographer, Helena Hutchins. According to records obtained by NPR, the state medical examiner determined that Hutchins' chest wound was caused by a bullet and deemed her death an accident. Alec Baldwin asserts his certainty that he is innocent in the shooting of Rust. Television Alec Baldwin asserts his certainty that he is innocent in the shooting of Rust. In a wintertime primetime interview with ABC News, Baldwin refuted accusations that he fired the shot. Never, he declared, would he point a gun at someone and pull the trigger. Baldwin continued, someone is accountable for what happened, but I can't tell who that is. But I'm aware that it's not me. Numerous lawsuits are still pending. Hutchins' family sued Baldwin and the production company for wrongful death following the unfortunate incident. Others who were on the set at the time Hutchins was killed, such as the script supervisor, the primary camera operator, and the primary medic for the production, have filed lawsuits due to the trauma they experienced. Baldwin's attorneys have also filed an arbitration suit against the production business, claiming that the actor is shielded from expenses and claims by language in his contract.